Hey everybody, welcome back to the Full Potential Parenting Podcast. I'm Allison Morris, and today I wanted to teach you how to tap. Tapping is a shorthand name for something called Emotional Freedom Techniques, or EFT. And I could go on and on about EFT and what it does and how it works, uh, but here's really all you need to know about it. Tapping helps you feel better and can lower your stress levels. Um, it helps lower cortisol levels in your body. Um, after just a few minutes of tapping, it can disrupt um, signals from your amygdala, so the part of your brain that gets you triggered. Um, and it can turn on good gene expression in your body. So protective genes associated with like good, uh, um, immune system response and um, other things like that. And turn off genes that are associated with inflammation and disease and stuff like that. So the, one of the easiest, easiest ways to learn how to tap is just take a deep breath and notice anywhere in your body that you feel stress or tension. Maybe it's your shoulders, maybe you've got like a tightness in the maybe your shoulder blades or the back of your neck, maybe in your jaw, wherever you feel it, notice that and give it a rating on a scale of zero to 10, where zero is it's totally fine and 10 is, it's like in, you're in pain. It's so tense. So just keep note of that, that number. Here's what we're gonna do. You're just gonna follow along. If you're listening um, just to the audio of this, you're gonna take one hand and you are going to tap with three fingers on the fleshy side of your hand on the other hand. So the part between your wrist and your little finger. Um, this used to be called the karate chop point. So if that is of value to you in figuring out where this part is, that's what it is. So, and then you're gonna repeat after me, just tap continuously while you repeat after me, even though I feel this tension in my fill in the blank. I'm gonna say my jaw. I deeply and completely accept myself. We're gonna repeat that two more times, even though I feel this tension in my jaw that you just put in your own part of your body. I deeply and completely accept myself. Even though I feel this tension in my jaw, I deeply and completely accept myself. Then take one hand, doesn't matter which one, go to the very top of your head and you tap there a few times while you repeat after me this tension. And we go to um, the inside edge of our eyebrow closest to our nose and just tap gently with one or two fingers. I feel it in my jaw. Side of the eye, tap really gently with one or two fingers on the eye socket, just outside your eye. All this tension. And slide under your eye, follow your eye socket under your eye. Tap there gently on the bone. All this tension in my body. And then down under your nose, above your upper lip, tap gently. All this tension in my body. And you're gonna go to below your lower lip. This is called the chin point. This tension in my jaw. Then we're gonna go down to what's called the collarbone point. Take, I like to take all five fingers, go below your collarbone. And I like to just tap all the way across my chest from one to the other. This tension in my jaw. And then comes the really odd part. And of course, this tapping with our fingers is why this is called tapping. You're gonna go under your arm with one hand, about four inches below the armpit, where a bra strap would cross on a woman. And you're gonna take, I'll let's get up on my tiptoes here so you can see me in the video. Or you can take your hand and reach across your body to your other, the other side of your body and tap there all this tension in my body. Now that's called one round of tapping. And when you're not explaining all the points, that takes 20 seconds maybe, 30, depending on 
the words that you're saying at each point. Take a deep breath in, let that out, and then check back in and see how you're feeling. Has anything loosened up? Is your jaw a little looser? Maybe your headache is gone down a little bit. Now it may not be that it's changed much. That was just one round of tapping. So we just go back. We go through, well, let's do another round. This time I'll go a little bit more quickly, right? So top of the head, this tension in my body, eyebrow point. I feel this tension in my jaw, side of the eye. I'm still holding tension in my jaw under the eye this tension in my body, under the nose. Feel this stress in my jaw, chin point. All the stress in my body, collarbone. Feeling the stress in my body. Under the arm, all this stress in my body. Now you may have just heard me have a big yawn there. I'm not tired. That was me releasing some energy, something that was kind of stuck inside. So if you sigh, if you yawn, all good signs that you're letting stuff go. Um, so give it a try. Maybe if, again, if, if it hasn't loosened things up for you, just keep tapping through a couple more rounds on your own. Um, I'm gonna lead you through more tapping sequences uh, in the future but I wanted to keep it super simple today just to give you a sense of what tapping is all about. Um, and you know, it still works even after you've stopped tapping. So sometimes the effects um, become clear a little bit after you've stopped. So thank you so much for joining me today. Go have a drink of water. That always helps too, help clear energy. And um, I'll see you at an, on another episode soon. And as always, want to invite you to hop on over to parentingmasterclass.com if you'd like to get some additional resources. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.